Hi bestie, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kiera. I make videos documenting my journey as a surgical technologist student. And today we're going to be doing a what's in my backpack video. Um, I was going to do a completely separate haul showing you guys everything that I bought for the school year. However, I did realize all the things that I went and got were pretty boring. They're pretty basic. And instead, I'm just going to show you guys everything that I just have in my school bag. Um, a lot of the things like 50-50 I've already had from previous years. I'm just reusing them or I just never got a chance to use. And then the other half I did buy new this year. So if you do want to see what I have in my backpack, just keep on watching. Find links for everything. I will be linking it down in the description because I'm pretty sure I can find majority of the things. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, so the backpack that I got is actually an old backpack. I've been using this since the start of my college career. Um, it is just the North Face Jester backpack. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if they still sell these, but it's just black with the teal. I think it's really cute. And I was going to buy a completely new bag, but I decided, no, there's like literally no point. This one, I'm pretty sure is one of their like basic models because it only has two pockets. I know some of them have like three or four, but this one has two pockets, but it's just big enough for everything that I need. And then it does come with two little um, water bottle compartments on the side. So I just put in a random bottle, but this is a bottle that I got off Amazon is really aesthetically pleasing. I won't be using this bottle the entire school year. Um, I will be like switching them out, but this is just the one that I have in for the purpose of this video. And then now we're gonna go ahead and open this first compartment. All right, so once you get it open, this is what the front looks like. It has a lot of different compartments where you can put pencils and pens and just organize it however you want to. So the first thing that I do have in here are my AirPods. Um, so this AirPod case I did get from Target. I don't know if they still sell them, but it's by Heyday and it's a hard, uh, it's like the hard case. And then next I just have this really cute pouch. So in here, I just have a charger, but this is where I will be keeping my phone charger as well as the charger for my MacBook. And then I also do just plan on throwing in here um, like ibuprofen because I, do, I am prone to getting migraines throughout the day. So I will be keeping my medication in here for that. Then of course, I will also have hand sanitizer. This is by um, Victoria's Secret Pink. And this is in the scent, what scent is this? Oh, pink melon. And then next, I just have this pencil pouch. I got this pencil pouch a few years ago. So it may be either from Walmart or Target. I'm not 100% for sure. But in here, we just have pencils and highlighters and things. So I do have a set of just the basic Sharpie highlighters. And then I also have a set of like the Up and Up brand, the Target brand, um, like skinnier highlighters. And then um, other than that, I just have mechanical pencils. I have like an eraser and I have whiteout. So basically everything in this pencil pouch are things that I've had from previous years. Um, the only thing new that I got for writing utensils are these pens. These are just the G2 ultra fine um, gel pens because I don't know. These are like the super ultra fine. So it's 0 0.38 milli millimeters. So these are the pens I'm going to be using this year. I do plan on attempting to go extreme, um, strictly digital for all of my notes, but we will see. I am going to, of course, bring pens and pencils and highlighters just in case if I am doing anything um, in class. But for the most part, I am going to be trying to go completely digital. So that's everything that's in that front pouch. Now we're going to go ahead and open those really big compartments. Okay, so when you open the main compartment, this is what you see. She's pretty packed. So the first thing I have, other than my phone, of course, is my iPad. I don't know which iPad this is, but this is just the one that I have. And um, it's the rose gold one. This case is from Amazon. And then I also have my Apple Pencil. I have like the first generation Apple Pencil. So that's what I'll be using. I downloaded GoodNote. So if you have any tips on using GoodNotes for school, please let me know. But I did download it and I've been playing with it for a couple weeks now, but that's what I'm going to be attempting to primarily use for back to school. 
Then next, I just have my laptop. So this case, it's also from Amazon. And I just keep my MacBook Air in here. So I just have the M1 MacBook Air. I actually did just purchase this laptop about two weeks two weeks ago. So this is something um, new, something I did splurge on. I do have a case coming in the mail, but I like I ordered it from an Etsy shop, but I didn't realize it was an Etsy shop in China. So it is going to be taking a few more weeks. I think maybe like one more week before it gets here. So I'm just going to try to post a picture or link it down below of the exact case that I have. But it's super cute. It's super minimalistic and I'm very excited to get it. So I will be taking my laptop to school just in case we have anything that does look like typing or I don't know, whatever the case may be. Um, however, I don't know if I will be taking both my iPad and my laptop to school every single day. The first week, of course, I will be taking it. But um, after that, I'll just decide which one I'll be using more um, and then that's the one I'll be taking to school every single day. Okay, so next up I got this planner. This planner is super boring. Um, I just wanted something super plain and simple. This I also got from Amazon and it's just the 2021 to 22, um, like academic planner. So for the start of each month, it just has like the month calendar, the monthly calendar. And then for each day, it has enough room for me to write everything in. I don't plan on using this for like all of my like everyday life appointments and things. This is only going to be used for the sole purpose of school. To go with it, I did get these little sticker sheets. Um, these are just for like if I have something super important that I need to do that's um, higher priority than the other things in my planner, then it'll get one of these stickers. I don't know where these are from. I feel like, oh, they're from Walmart. Hmm. These are from Walmart. Um, and I'll be using these, like I said, in the planner for things that are like high priority or whatever the case may be. Next, I have two notebooks. Um, these notebooks I had from previous years, I just bought too many and I never used them. So like I said, I do plan on doing digital notes, but if there is something that I need to write down, I'll be using one of these notebooks. I don't actually think I'm going to be taking both of them. I think I'm just use a teal one because it matches my book bag, but I do have two of them and they're just a one subject college ruled notebook, you know, the basic um, but yeah, so if I just need to write anything down, this is where I'll be writing them in. Lastly, I got just a plain five star folder. I did not realize I got the with the prongs, but I got prongs. I don't need prongs. But this is where I will just be putting any important um, papers that my professor gives me or a syllabus or whatever. So I do have notebook paper. I did put the notebook paper in the sheet protector. Um, I am going to take paper just because I do know we have tests every single week. I don't know. If it's going to be a notebook paper, we have to get Scantrons, but they didn't save any Scantrons, so I didn't get them. <laughs> I need to study with note cards, so I did get a 300 pack off of Amazon. These are actually just completely blank. I didn't realize that when I ordered them, but it'll work out just fine. Um, and I, whenever I have tests or um, quizzes, I really need to study with note cards. And then I also got, I already opened them because I started trying to study already, but I got um, some from Target as well with the different colors and so these will be like my number one study materials especially when it comes for exams and studying the instruments. As far as books go we actually do not have to purchase books for my class. Um, well we actually did technically purchase them it was included our books are included with our tuition so I believe we're getting four textbooks for my classes um, so I'll be getting those on my first day of school. I completely forgot to mention when I did go and get my MacBook two um, weeks ago, I did go on the Apple education store. So if you are a higher education student, they are doing the promotion that they do every single year where if you buy a MacBook or if you buy a MacBook or an iPad Pro, then you get um, free AirPods. I think sometimes they also do Beats. I was really hoping they were going to do Beats because I literally already have like two sets of AirPods, but they do give you free AirPods. So um, I think the promotion lasts until September. So if you are thinking about getting a MacBook or an iPad, uh, you probably won't go ahead and get it now if you want to get the free AirPods. All right, guys, so that is everything that I'll be carrying with me to school for the school year 2021 to 2022. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any feedback or suggestions, please leave it down below. This is only my second video, so I am trying to get more comfortable in front of the camera as well as getting a little bit better with editing because I will admit my first video was very chopping with the editing. So I'm trying to do better with the filming and the editing. So once again, if you have any feedback or suggestions, please leave them down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you are going back to school this year, I wish you the best of luck and you're going to do awesome, babe. You're going to do awesome. <laughs> Bye.